I'm having like genuine fun. That is the thing with MW, like streaming three hours on that game is difficult. Dude, you just got fucking destroyed. Don't even try that shit ever again. Dude. That was a nice shot, or else I can't. Nice ass collab. Oh. Oh, that was a nice collab. I choked, bro. Oh my god. Dude, I heard footsteps and literally just. Bro, that kid had no chance. No chance at all. Dude, you just, bro, get out of my face. Get out of here. Oh my god. So confused on so many levels. All right, what's up, guys? It's Morris, and I hope you enjoyed those clips. There should be more at the end of the video. Right now, I have a gameplay going in the background. I think I go 40 and 11 and have some nice streaks in it. So I hope you enjoy that. Uh, I just want to ask, how did you guys enjoy the alpha? Um, personally, I liked it a lot. My shot wasn't very good for probably the middle part of it because I streamed for so long. I was just tired and just. I lost my shot and spiked my controller, so my controller, like, I had to switch over to bumpers on my controller because my right trigger stopped working, and it just, if you were in the stream, you know, I tried playing keyboard and mouse, I tried playing with an old controller, it, it wasn't a good time, but my controller is working again, so we're chilling. I also want to ask, what do you hope gets fixed for the beta or the full game? Um, for me, skill-based matchmaking is obviously the big one, like, Especially when you're playing in a party, it's just almost unfair the lobbies you get in. Sometimes it feels like you're playing against people way out of your skill level. So, I don't know, maybe I'm just good. Maybe they're being nice to me. But uh, another thing, though, is outside of skill based matchmaking, because everyone obviously hates skill based matchmaking. Yeah, the only people that like it are people that don't really understand what goes on in it, I guess, because they think, oh, it puts you with similar skilled players. I you, if you're not good at the game, there's people who are good at the game that reverse boost to get easier lobbies. So it's just a lose-lose for everyone. But another big thing for me was the name plates, dude. Like the blue names that go above teammates. Like there were so many times I see a teammate and an enemy and the name plate is to the left of my teammate. So it's over the enemy. So I end up trying to shoot my teammate and just like, just choke it. Just chalk. It's chalked. It's 
ruined. So I hope they fix that. It's, it's such an easy fix. It's also like backing out mid game with your party. That's one thing I hope gets fixed as well. Cause it should, that should not be an issue. Um, and apparently I guess there's aim assist on like on snipers. I'm aim slow down. So it's technically aim assist. I didn't notice it. I, I don't know if I just like, I don't know, just am obl that oblivious to it, but I did not notice any slowdown, but uh, Carnage Rye, he actually, he's a crazy player, by the way. He uploaded a Twitter video where he's swiping over an AFK player and it was slowing down a decent amount. So maybe, I, I guess it wasn't off. I guess they were lying to us. I, I have no idea. Whoever was telling us there was no aim assist, they're liars I, or something. Maybe it's part of them buffing the snipers to get data for the alpha because that's tony flame one of the lead devs also said uh, that they buffed the snipers for this part of the alpha or for this alpha i i don't understand why but they did apparently to score streaks dude i don't fuck where they on about with the score streaks man like <laughs> the end end game every game is just chopper gunners that's all it is it's chopper gunners from people who aren't able to actually get them with skill uh, it's so strange to me. I, I think the perfect uh, score streak system they had was probably MW3. MW3 was amazing. You could choose between either specialist, uh, kill streak, well active uh, kill streaks. So it was like strong, powerful kill streaks, but you had to be a lot. Like you had to get seven kills in one life to get it, uh, or a certain. I can't remember if it was kills or score in MW3. But then there were support streaks, they were like non-lethals, like it was an advanced UAV, it was an EMP, stuff like that, that, or a SAM turret I think there was as well, but it lasted the whole game. So if you got 20 kills or 2000 score or whatever during the game, it would grant you those kill streaks, those score streaks. But if you change your class, it reset. I think that system was just absolutely perfect. Uh, the game types too, man. Kill confirmed and TDM play pretty slow and kind of rough. I think domination and hardpoint are really fun. Domination, I'm so glad they came back closer to the original domination spawns. Domination in Modern Warfare, it's so bad, especially on Miami. Dude, Team Deathmatch and Kill Confirmed just play so unbelievably slow. They gotta do something about that map. They gotta, there's too many, sections of the map you can't have that many in a 6v6 map it'd be okay for ground war for 9v9 hopefully they have that in cold war because like if you if you know who i am i was a black ops 2 ground war player that was my my peak my pride and the fact that they have not had legitimate 9v9 in the last like three years two years so i think world war 2 was the last time i miss it man i need it back uh, give, give me back 9v9 that because miami would work great in 9v9 yeah man I, overall i really enjoyed I enjoyed the alpha a lot. Uh, the beta is coming out October 8th, so I'm gonna be making videos on Modern Warfare. Hopefully you enjoy them. I'm excited for it. I'm wondering what they're gonna fix by then. I'm so excited for the full game. I'm excited. That's that's all I gotta say, man. Like just last time there was a boots on the ground, like a true boots on the ground Treyarch game. I played it for six years. That was that was Black Ops 2, man. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I appreciate it a lot. Make sure. If you haven't already, if you made it to this point of the video, make sure you drop a like, comment, and subscribe on the video, man. Uh, it means a ton. We're almost to 3K, so let's get there quick. Uh, recent video should be popping up now, and I'll see you guys next time. G fucking G. 22 and 5, not the heck. David went 20. Oh my god!